Hi, good morning everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Rosa Technocrat. Uh, today I am here with another issue that uh, I have observed recently on FortiGate. And this issue was about uh, traffic logs being generated from uh, 127.001. Let's talk about that. Recently, I logged into the FortiGate. I observed, uh, like one of my customer reported, uh, they are seeing a lot of traffic uh, which is being generated from an IP address of 127.0.0.1, and the destination is also 127.0.0.1. So uh, I, I'm here to inform you more about these logs. Uh, uh, if you are thinking like why this traffic is being generated or uh, whether it is uh, something to be worried. <clears throat> so rest assured, uh, this is uh, uh, nothing bad or nothing going to impact on your firewall. Uh, th there are some new features which are being introduced in uh, 40 gate firmware version 7.0 onwards. So if you see traffic in your firewall generating from these uh, local or loopback IP address, then it's absolutely normal. And uh, no, uh, so as you can see here on the screen, uh, the log is all about 127, the loopback IP address and destined towards the loopback address, but on uh, service port 9980. Apart from 9980, you might see other traffic uh, uh, on two, three more ports that is like 80, 443 and 12121. So the, the, these are because of uh, some services that are being introduced or enhancement where a local daemon on FortiGate is uh, listening on to these ports to verify the security fabric. Security fabric is like when all the connected devices are Fortinet. So uh, you, you might see some traffic related to 127.001 and the other ports are these ones. You can see here destination port 80, 12121 and as we saw in the previous that is 9980 so you don't have to worry these uh, uh, traffic this traffic is uh, self generated and only for the firewall it's not going to impact anything okay so uh, th this can also be seen in the configuration like why these uh, this communication is happening uh, but uh, these uh, configurations are hidden by default. Basically, the command that is used to see this is hidden. So if you type uh, command and then the question mark, you won't be able to uh, see this. So if you want to verify these uh, services running or these uh, ports listening, you can uh, check for which ports are listening onto the firewall. And also you can check the log uh, config log uh, configuration for the 48. <coughs> So, uh, as I explained, when the source and destination IP are 127.001 is used, then the communication is internal to the firewall. Uh, these logs are normal and it will not cause any issue. Uh, communication to port UDP 12121 was introduced from 702 and this is a new WebSocket server enhancement for an event log WebSocket notifications. This configuration can be verified by using uh, the command so log tab device and you will see the configuration regarding the same but please note this is a hidden command hence you will have to type it completely that's what I was telling like it's a hidden command uh, if you put question mark then it, it will not show this command. So uh, th this is how this can be verified I can even show you like on a uh, live device let's go to our live device. Da, da, da. Okay, here. <clears throat> so if I go on to a forty gate and if I do so, log tab. If you can see here first, it's not going to show anything here like tab. There is no tab. But if you keep on typing and if you do, then it shows so log tab device. So if you go under so log tab device, you will be able to see the port is set to one to one. And this is for uh, like uh, some <clears throat> security fabric. Basically, it's an internal communication for this. So uh, th this is what I was talking about. If you want to verify, you can verify by using this. And you don't have to uh, worry like why these logs are generated or will it impact anything. Okay, so uh, you can also verify at your end. 
let's go continue okay so this is how you can verify and uh, the reference this is the reference from where I got this information and like during troubleshooting I came to know about this so if you want you can also visit this uh, for more information uh, thank you that was a very short topic today because it has nothing to do much troubleshooting but this is just a informational video uh, about local traffic being uh, local traffic logs being generated as 127.001 so this was an informational video on to this and you can verify this thank you so much if you like this information please do like and subscribe my channel thank you so much